Hey, what's up guys? It's Barbara Bote and I'm back with another video. This one's going to be a review on the new Maybelline foundation, the Dream Velvet Foundation. So if you want to see my review and demo on these foundations, just keep on watching. Okay guys, so here are the Dream Velvet foundations. I'll give you a close-up of them in another clip, but the they come in a tube sort of packaging, sort of like a cream, like a hand cream type packaging. So the two shades I have are 92 and 95. 92 is called caramel and 95 is called coconut. So I do have to mix these two foundations. I got them at Walmart for $9.98 so they're basically like $10 at Walmart but I'll leave the retail price below. Let's see what they claim to do. They say they are a soft matte hydrating foundation and it says it's our first gel whipped foundation and I absolutely love this foundation like I feel like I finally found a foundation that I love um, when you apply them they apply like a almost like a cream so it feels like um, a thick it has a very thick consistency I would say that they are full coverage the finish is what I love about them the most they dry to a velvety finish and a velvety finish is my favorite finish because they dry um, almost to a skin like consistency and I really love that about them I'm wearing um, these two right now of course I have my concealer and everything on as well but this foundation is just beautiful it really just makes the texture of my it improves the texture of my face the appearance of the texture of my face so I love that about it for the cons about it is that it's a lot darker than what they appear in the tube my lighting is kind of washing them out but when I do give you the close-up you'll see uh, that they are darker than what they appear to be in the tube I um, the reason I do have to mix is because these are the darkest two darkest shades and a lot of companies have this flaw that there is no like in between of the darkest shade and the second the darkest shade and I fall somewhere in between what I love about it is that it just anything that you put on top of it it just looks so much better um, I, it um as you can see my highlight right here it just it's like butter on top of it you know it's just so nice I'll show you the consistency right now all right so here's the consistency of them as you can see they are not going anywhere on my hand they're very thick um, and here's caramel right here and here's coconut right there so there's not honestly there's not that big of a difference between the two darker shades and I really do wish that they had more darker shades more deeper shades but if you are my skin tone definitely try mixing these two okay guys so off camera I applied my Smashbox primer water because my skin has been very dry lately and my Becker Ever Matte Poreless Perfector and these are of course the foundations, the Maybelline Dream Velvet in number 92, which is caramel, and number 95, which is coconut. And I'm just going to mix these two together. I'm going to squeeze the two on the back of my hands. Um, I'm going to use the darker shade first, and then the lighter shade after. And squeeze them, uh, mix them, the two together. And I'm going to use um, <clears throat> a Real Techniques um, pointed foundation brush to do so. And I'm just going to paint it on my face, however, nothing neat or precise. Just wherever I need it and it's pretty much going to apply it everywhere. Then I'm going to go ahead and take my crown brush. It's a flat top kabuki brush. It's a really dense brush and I love it for full coverage and looks. It's an amazing brush. You guys should get it. And I'm just going to um, apply this foundation all over my face. And as you can see, it's full coverage and applies very smoothly. And I'm just pushing the foundation in and just slightly rubbing it in. Um, not really all the way rubbing it on my skin. Then I'm, um, as you can see, it applies kind of light. But this is the final look of how it looks. As you can see, it looks really good. Um, it evened out my skin. And it just looks really smooth and um, skin like, which is what I like about it. And this is how it looks with the full shebang with the concealer highlighting contouring everything so i hope you guys enjoyed this look. 
subscribe to me for more videos and of course give this video a thumbs up if you liked it leave me a comment too guys follow me on all my social media and i'll see you in the next one guys bye